欢迎各位同学好，欢迎来到 Forty Phoenix 自然音标 ，Forty Phoenix 自然音标的课程。今天老师为你介绍的是 Vocabulary of the Day，Vocabulary of the Day。同样的，我们今天可以到 cn.com，edition.cn.com 去寻找本人的 Headline News of the Day， 并且从中去学习一些单字的拼音技巧以及逻辑。Okay, students, let's go to the cn.com, edition.cn.com, and search for the headline news of the day. And we can probably pick up some vocabulary words and learn their pronunciation rule and scale. Okay, let's take a look. Today, under the session, flight of fancy, flight of fancy. And here the article title for today. Meanwhile, world's longest flight is coming. Meanwhile, world's longest flight is coming. Okay, let's check this article. And students, if you wish to study with me with these articles. Right here on the top right hand side, you will see a search menu. What I want you to do is, here is the article title for today. If you、uh, wish to study with me,、uh, you just type the article title into the search menu. Okay, the search,、uh, the title for today is the article for today is. Qatar Airways may launch world's longest flight. Again, Qatar Airways may launch world's longest flight. Qatar Airways may launch world's longest flight. A planned direct flight between Doha, Qatar, and Auckland, New Zealand, may be the world's longest. Okay, let's take a look at、uh, inside news. Okay, let's enlarge. Okay, now seeing that the whopping eighteen half hour journey between Doha, Qatar. And Auckland, New Zealand, is supposed to become the world's longest direct flight if Qatar Airways follows through with the plans for the new route. Qatar CEO Akbar Al Baker revealed plans for the ultra long haul in an interview with the Bloomberg Business at last week's Bahrain Air Show. Boeing 777 LR aircraft will will be used to make the trip. Bloomberg Business reported the aircraft can carry 259 passengers. No word yet on when the airline airline might start the service. Currently, the world's longest flight is operated by Qatar's between Dallas, Fort Worth, and Sydney, according to the. Statistic portal, statistic.com, as 16 hour and 55 minutes, 5,8,577 miles, 13,804 kilometers. The Qatar's flight duration falls short of Qatar's proposed Doha Auckland route, 9,034 miles and 14,000. 539 kilometer by more than an hour and a half. Setting record for flight distance or duration is a moving target. Emirates airline is set to eclipse current front runner quotas in the spring when it launches a route from Dubai to Panama City. Panama that will last 17 hours and 35 minutes, and the Singapore Airlines, which held the record for the longest non-stop flight until 
has considered taking the title back with a possible resumption of its nearly 19-hour flights between New York and Singapore. Okay, student, I'm gonna stop right here and、uh, let's go for the note I have prepared for you guys to study. And、uh, okay, let's open up the note. Okay, now, ah,、uh, let's ah,、uh, let's say, let's read along with me with the headline title for today with me. Let's follow me. Aviation, world's longest flight is coming. Aviation. World's longest flight is coming. Aviation. World's longest flight is coming. Okay, now let's go to the vocabulary for today, and there are two vocabulary words for today, and now we're going to discuss those vocabulary words, meaning, usage, pronunciation, and definition. And we are using spelling bees, pronunciation, and spelling improvement and a skill. Okay, student, let's take a look at the first vocabulary words: flight, flight, flight. Definition of flight in English: none. The action or process of flying through the air. An eagle in flight. The history of space flight. More example sentences. We were being processed for flying by a talking orange. Origin of English flight. Action or manner of flying of Germanic origin, relative to Dutch vulture and the fly. This was probably merging Middle English with an. On recording all English word relative to German flocked, flocked, and to fleet, which is re represented by sen three of the num. Okay, let's take a look at the second vocabulary words. Root. 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 Definition of root in English. Num a way or a course taken in getting from a starting point to a destination. The most direct route is via Los Los Angeles. More example sentences. Amy's limo was currently taking the Sydney route, which is eventual destination as the Ishiyama Mansion. Origin Middle English from Old French root, road, from Latin rupta, va, broken way, feminine, past participle of rupia. Okay, now. Now I'm going to repeat the pronunciation and definition part again, and、uh, students, if you wish, ah,、uh, I. What I want you to do, just read along with me. Let's follow me with the pronunciation and definition. Flight. 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 Definition of flight in English: num. The action or process of flying through the air. An eagle in flight. The history of space flight. More example sentences. We were being processed for flying by a talking orange. Origin: Old English flight, action or manner of flying, of Germanic origin relative to Dutch vulture and the flight. This was probably merged in Middle English with an unrecorded Old English word relative to German "flocked" and to flee, 
which is represented by sense three of the norm. Okay, now it's the time for second vocabulary word. Root. 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 Definition of root in English. Numb. A way or course taken in getting from starting point to a destination. The most direct route is Var Los Angeles. More example sentences. Emmy's limo was currently taking the scenic route, which is eventual destination as the Ishiyama Mansion. Origin Middle English from Old French root root from Latin rupta from broken way feminine past participle of rompir. Okay, students, now it's a time we're going to redefine those two vocabulary words, and we're going to use phonics spelling and pronunciation improvement and the skill. Take a look at the first vocabulary words. Flight. 好的，同学们，我们看 flight， 古英文 f l y h t 啊，古英文的是 f l y h t 啊，所以我们可以看啊，古英的话呢，拼法是有点不一样了哈，啊，有点像我们讲的 flight， 再加一个 h t 哈，所以啊比较特别哈。那我们看 flight 单音节的单字，所以我们看它的 onset。F nucleus 合音在 I coda 尾音在 G H T 好、哦，所以首音开头子音 F 合音主要母音位置 I 尾音结尾子音 coda G H T 当然，我们知道，当 nucleus 加 coda 等于 rhymes 等于韵音啊，所以我们看它的韵音哈、啊，所以我们看它组合是 consonant vowel consonant 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 c v c c c 啊，也就是我们讲的 consonant 子音 vowel consonant 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 啊，子母，子子子，好、啊，子母子子子，那我们只要取 nucleus 加 coda 这一段，也就是这一段了哈，也就是 v c c c 的组合，啊，记得 v c v c c v c c c， 他们都会得到一个答案，就是 short vowels， 啊 ，short vowels， 短母音。啊，一般来说是这样哈 ，short vowels， 但是呢，一般是这样写哈，但是 flight 不一样哦。啊 ，flight 我们要画一个特别的箭头符号，就是朝上的箭头符号。啊，我们称它的单独向上的母音。啊，啊，记得哈。那也就是说，这个母音它后面虽然都是子音，但是它却是要念长母音。比如当你是 i g h i g h t 啊啊或者 o l d o l t， 他们的 o 要念长母音 ，i 要念长母音，好，所以这个地方我们在 g h 不发音 ，t 啊，所以它念什么 f l i g 哦、oh, ，sorry 哈、啊，我刚刚写错了一个字，这是 flight 哈、啊，今天要教的是 flight， 不是 fight。啊，所以它是 C C V C C C， 啊，所以 onset F L 哈，因为我刚刚啊没注意到这边哈这个字哈，所以今天要教的是 flight， 所以我们再来再写一遍 flight F L I G H T C C V C C C， 啊 consonant consonant vowel consonant consonant consonant， 所以这时候我们在 I 的地方画一个直接向上的母音符号啊，箭头朝上。代表它是单独朝上的母音哈 ，g h 打叉，因为它叫做 silent， 不发音 ，g h silent，g h 不发音
。好，所以我们看它的组合呢，啊，很特别哈 ，flight， 啊 ，flight。好，那刚才的 fight 怎么念呢？记不记得老师讲 i g h t g h 也是不发音，所以也是念 fight。好，所以你可以看多哈，好像 n i g h t 呢 ，night， 哦，也是一样 g h 不发音啊。所以当 g h 不发音时，前面那个 i 就会拉成长母音。再一遍 ，fight。啊 ，g h 不发音。好，所以我们 i 是用的什么 long vowel again f i g h t flight long vowel i silent g h flight。好，那我们接下来看第二个单词是什么呢 ？root。root 有两个念法哈。有两个念念 root 或 route， 好 ，root 或 route， 我们先来解释这两种不同的发音形式。首先 ，root， 我们看它的什么呢？啊的 onset， 啊又是单音节，所以 onset 是 r， 啊 nucleus， 牛克里斯 ，l u。Code T E， 所以我们可以用什么 R V V C E 啊 ，semi R 啊，假性母音 R， 母母子尾音 E 啊，这是第一种念法哈，第一种念啊，第一种念法啊，我们来把这个当成 Code 哈，所以 nucleus and Code equals rhyme. 所以呢，它有两种念法。第一个是 r o u t e。好，那我们在这边画个双啊，双连音啊，然后一打叉，这念 route, route, route， 就是拿 o 跟 u 做双连双母音，好 ，t 不发音。O 跟 U 念双母音 ，T 不发音 ，route， 好，所以这念 route。所以有的人他不不看不看后面的 E 的话，他就念 route，route。Deep sound O U R route。那另外一个念法呢，就是我们刚刚讲的哈 ，V V C E。那不看第一个 E， 套用 V C E vowel。Consonant e 母子一，母子一就会念长母音了哈，所以这样过来画过来，所以第一个第一个这两个不看了哈，这两个不看了，这边打个叉 ，r o u t e 啊，这边打个叉，这边画过来，那这 u 念长母音 ，root root。Root 啊 ，Root 是这样念的哈，也就是 U T E as root, U T E vowel consonant E, U 这边打个叉 ，Root 或者我们念 Route, R O U T E, O U as deep sound, All silent E, Root， 所以你要么写 long vowel U。Root， 或者是 deep sound o u o r route， 所以有两个念法哈，在字典上。好，这句这就是我们在讲哈，这个自然发音的特别哈。有的人他会抓 o u 做做这个双母音啊，不去看 e 啊，所以念啊 root route 啊，也有人啊看这个母子 e 的结尾啊，念 u 的长母音念 root。好，这就是差异性啊，为什么会标两个音哈？好，所以稍微看一下哈啊，这两个单字的念法哈，就是所以有同学说，哎，老师到底要念 root 还是念 route？ 好，其实两个两种念法都有人哈，它是不同的规则产生出来的哈。
Okay, let's check it out the vocabulary. 那我们重做一遍 Flight, flight, flight. Route, route, route. Route, route, route. 好的，同学们，如果你觉得 David 老师用这种自然发音 phonetic 的方式带领你啊、呃、进入 phonetic 音标的世界，好，并且用 phonetic 去解释啊、呃、这些母音啊、呃、单字的发音的技巧逻辑，运用了什么规则啊？例如，我们用线形符号的箭头来表达母音的短母音、长母音、双母音以及轻母音的发音形式，以及线形符号来表达。特殊的子音、特殊发音方法啊，有帮助到你的拼音技巧逻辑的话，也欢迎大家用 Google Plus 啊 ，Sorry， 用 Google Plus 加 David 老师做好友啊 ，Google Plus 啊 ，David 老师 ID David T T I N G 8 8 g o o g l e Plus 啊 ，Friends 啊 ，If you 啊、uh, find my pronunciation videos are useful 啊、uh, ，You can try 啊、uh, ，Google Plus。Uh, add my user ID David T T I N G A D A into your friend circle, and also if you wish to write me an email, my email account is David T T I G A D A at gmail dot com, and I I'm also using line communicator. My line D is David T one six eight A. Feel free to send me a message. Uh, and last, thanks for your video watching and sharing my pronunciation videos. If you find my videos are useful. Please subscribe my YouTube channel. Ah,、uh, 当然啊， uh, 觉得有用的话，订一下啊，订、uh, 阅 David 老师的 YouTube channel. 啊、uh, ，那以上就是今天的 vocabulary of the day. 谢谢各位同学的观赏。